Hey guys, quick video, and this is going to involve making fire using solar ignition. So we're just going to use a magnifying lens to use use the sun's heat concentrated on a tinder bundle so it can catch fire. Now obviously, you need sun for that. So if it's a cloudy day, it, it, we're, it's kind of cloudy right now, so we're just going to try to work on it right in between the clouds. Um, so if it's cloudy or nighttime, obviously it doesn't work. If you're like in a canopy in a jungle or forest, it's not going to work. You need, you know, you need direct contact with the sun. So luckily for me, I live in the desert where we get plenty of sun and there's vast open spaces so it's gonna work good for me just in between these clouds okay so obviously the first thing you're gonna need is a magnifying lens now on my pack I always have one here it's not in all honesty it's not my favorite form of ignition but it's always good to have a good three or four backups to make fire so it's always handy when I need it so here it is now just um, I think any magnification lens will do as long as it's over five power. Mine is seven, so it should work just fine. Okay, let me just put my pouch back. So I'm going to use this, and I'm going to use it over here. Now, this can work just fine like this. You can just aim it, and it can start burning. The problem with that, though, is it is kind of getting cloudy. So I'm going to just use a little cheat. Just to speed things along, I'm also on my way to shoot a different video, so it's kind of running late here, but. Okay, I'm gonna use a little old woodsman cheat. Now you know about char cloth. If you don't know about char cloth, I have a video on that. It's a very easy way to start fire because it guarantees an ember. So I'm gonna have a video on that. Feel free to check that out if you haven't seen it. And every outdoors person should have a little tin to make char cloth. It just guarantees fire during emergencies or when you're in a hurry. So I'm going to get my piece of char cloth, place it in here as if it's an egg, like pretend this is a bird's nest. And in the hollow, I'm going to place it. And we got to hurry because it's the sun's about to go into a... into a cloud. So I'm going to concentrate it there. Let it start burning. Once it does that, I'm going to blow softly onto it. Oh, let's just wait because it's still under some cl some clouds. Let me see. If I can get it over here. See that? Okay, so let's put this away. Turn it around. And then start pla placing some fuel on it. I'm gonna poke some holes to make sure the fire is capable of escaping. go it's a little messy but like I said we're short on time as long as you get the point of it now once again this you need the sunlight now understandable now understandable it's very hot out here we're in the desert so me being out here trying to start a fire with this risks heat stroke and hyperthermia and dehy dehydration so what you can do is Go somewhere where there's a fire, well, I mean, I'm sorry, where there's sun, get your fire going, and then go take it somewhere where you already have shade. So you can have a fire nearby, but you can be able to rest. So, let me get my cup out. Say we had that tender bundle. Had I started it, placed it in here, in my tender bundle, and I could have carried this quickly to a place of shade so I could have it nearby, but I could get away from the fire. So I can 
be able to get some rest from the sun because it is very hot out here. Even though it's kind of cloudy, it's extremely hot. Okay, another thing to keep in mind is that this works best during summer. Winter, it becomes a little harder and it just, it works best during the zenith hours of the sun. So from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m., this is gonna work great. After that, it gets a little harder. We're a little bit past that. We're about at, it's about to be three o'clock right now. And um, yeah, it's a, there's a lot of clouds right now. So we're just trying to work in between the clouds and we had to kind of hurry it up and use some char cloth. So once again, it can work without the char cloth, but we're in a hurry, so we had to use a little cheat. So you, hopefully you can see how handy this comes. And uh, yeah, that's a quick video for today. Hope you learned something from this and um, 